Okay, so this video is with regards to fixing a slow performing Android phone or a freezing screen. I get this a lot. I run the Samsung, I've got a Samsung SG5. It's one of the older phones now. Just can't bear to be bothered to upgrade it on a con an expensive contract that I don't use. So, um, anyone who's got a slow, uh, an old or even a newer phone than the SG5, you'll still probably come across a problem of the phone eventually slowing down and this the reason behind this is because you've got a lot of applications with cached data which is like it's almost like memory leaking because you've closed these applications down but there's still a particular part of your memory on your phone assigned to that application and there's the only only one way to fix all these memory leaks so you free up more active memory just for general performance of your phone such as navigating so you just want to go into the apps option here and then browse to your settings so on newer phones it will be very similar as well we want to find uh, something called applications or application manager which you can search for as well rather than scrolling down and missing it here we go so under applications here we've got application manager and then it's just going to list all the applications that you've got on your phone uh, so here we go we've got endless applications all sorts of junk and you just want to go through each one and make sure there's no cash for that particular application or there's not a great deal of clash cash and then you want to clear it if there is so you need to go through each application and do this this will in turn free up a lot of memory on your phone that's not actually been assigned efficiently so here we go it's taking ages just to uh, actually find how much cached memory i've got here we go we've got 92 kilobytes so clear there we go go to the next one no idea what the bloody hell that does don't need that AccuWeather, here we go, that's quite a big one, doesn't sound too much, 2.6 megabytes, but it is actually a fair amount of, oops, just done that, memory to assign to something I'm not using, clear, AdSense, clear, what is this not? Airbnb, let's get rid of, oh, that's a big deal, okay, 11 bytes there. I'll never use these applications as well, once a blue moon, but there's so much cached memory for each particular one. Amazon, antivirus, that might have a, no, it's not too bad. So most of these, your cache should come up rather quickly, and therefore you can browse and clear these quick fashion we'll be here all day though there's so many of them like some of them won't take much cash up whereas others will as you do this you might start to see your phone actually respond a little bit better as more memory gets freed up from all these useless applications you might use ones every now and then. So after you've painstakingly been through each one, then your phone should start responding again. Um, I don't think you'll have to do it so often as well because most of these you won't use that often. Just remember that when you do use one, that you're not going to use in, you know, you're going to use it once a blue moon, then you'll want to go into the cache and clear it again because if you're not going to reopen that on a daily or weekly basis, there's no point in leaving memory fixed to that particular application. Whereas the applications you are actually going to use regularly, there's not much point in actually clearing the cache. So you just want to target applications that you don't use as regularly. I mean, Google Maps, I mean, everyone uses it so regularly, but if you know you're not going to use it maybe, you know, within the next week 
Oh, I don't know, next three or four days, you might even want to go in and clear that because that takes a big amount of that, 55 megabytes for me, you see. So uh, that is quite a big one to actually clear Google Maps. So you want to bear that in mind. PayPal, uh, you see, so Google Maps had the biggest for me, but I've cleared a fair bit then. Now, hopefully, um, as I start scrolling through my phone in the future and stuff, My phone should get a lot more speedier again. Um, so, give that a go and then let me know how your phone performs. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> so give that a go and let me know how your phone